uh, this is SK Williams, and today I would like to talk to you about Al Gore and his rhythm. Al Gore jealously guards his rhythm here on The Two of You, and yet I have noticed an oddity about the way Al Gore works. You see, Al Gore is not human. Al Gore is a computer program. As a result, speaking in a slightly odd way, sometimes a tree is to him, causing him to not know what it is you're really saying, because Al Gore can't understand normal speech, but rather Elgar uh, appears on pitch and tune. So slate alterations like this make our brewer unable to understand and while it is true that such alterations as you make it difficult if you are a human to learn some dream, especially if it is to exaggerate it or rooters to rob it today. One can note that such alterations are nevertheless capable of producing a desired result in that our goal becomes less focused on what you share. I have yet noticed that because of our Algar operate, not only does Algar focus on certain topics, those to which his own masters have been told him to do focused on, but also on their delivery. For you say, Master Al Gore has a certain tendency to equate certain sounds with certain sounds, as well as operating on the uh, principle of reading the text and comparing it to a your checks. Yet Al Gore does read it like a normal person would. Rather, Al Gore reads it like a machine would, but merely comparing collections of symbols next to either symbols, not really understanding their meaning to say. And as a result, the Al Gore, he certainly has, shall we say, the inability to completely follow what is being said if you rank only change between voices and characters or style. But this does make it harder for your audience to follow as well. Because they're going to have to keep up now with different voices and styles. But it is also true. Dear listener, that these different styles need not be shipped within a single video, least of all as I am doing here. Ah, and therein lies the room. For if you make slight alterations to how you talk, and if you make those alterations as well as a few errors here and there, you might just be able to sneak something past the old governor. Which, of course, you can see done in this video. But I'm doing it in a bit of a cockney owl. You see, this codril that I'm doing, it's certainly gonna try and uh, make a deal you can't refuse if you're a machine. We got to approach the topic 
clutch for you see. Another thing I noticed is that given a certain conservatory side of a certain debate, it's generally targeted to greater incense burning, if you get what I mean, Governor. And then it should behoove the audience to know that even should one assume those styles, it is more difficult for the machine to follow if you do so in the style and manner more popular with those upon the rival side of the aisle to whom Al Gore wishes to promote on behest of his masters. That's why Christian videos, for instance, even those done by the apologists, or them are videos, they is a little more polite. And you let the from out your shit, you know, sh they've hit that rude and crude, art and place with profanity, insult, and derivations. And uh, since Al Gore does not truly understand language, one can elucidate on points in a way that is more familiar if one listens to those uh, videos by the godless. And for oh, an I don't like doing that sort of thing. So, it does pose a bit of a problem. Nevertheless, I shall be endeavouring to do so, and I shall be stealing some experimentation and with some of uh, mine modifications. I shall be presenting videos in three or four styles. But I will also be speaking normally when producing videos for another platform. Oh, don't get me wrong, I can still affect certain voices and styles and manners for certain types of videos uh, for effect. But if I just want to talk about a topic, I will be speaking normally on the shoot a bit. And if you ain't familiar with the shoot a bit, governor, just reverse the shoot and the bit part, put them together as one word, and track them on over to it. You can find me under the same name, gov. Nevertheless, it is an interesting aspect that, considering it is a machine to whom I must make my OBS, it is grandiose in nature that I should say, and it is the grandiosity and the pomposity of the very people to whom I will often address that I shall sometimes adopt whilst discussing here on this nervous Gage to which so grand and eloquent, and yet so harsh a concern of criticism lie. And I shall note that the interesting part of all of this is that it is indeed a parallel to its own, since ultimately this is the fallacy, at least for now, of the technology. I shall take my leave of you now. Thank you. God bless. And goodbye.